Hey everybody, welcome back to Paper Mario. My name is Ruben Kings and welcome to the new episode. Today, we are going to continue with our journey. Last time, we fell through the sky because Bowser was a little shit and decided to kidnap Princess Peach again. So, we are going to have to go through a journey and we're going to actually try to rescue her this time again. But we're going to go through a long journey, so let's do it again. Hmm, well, we find the hammer, so I guess we should head for home. Okay. Youch! Oh, I wonder who's coming next. Oh, here we are. Who are you guys? This is my playground, idiots! Nobody sets foot in here without my permission. Nobody! Prepare to start crying at the feet of Master Junior Trooper! Honestly, guys, this character that I'm introducing to you is one of my favorite characters in this whole entire series, and I really wish they used him more in later games. This is Junior Troopa. He's a boss of the neighborhood gang. A bit of a bully, obviously. He's more bark than bite. You can beat him easily. Just boost yourself up. Don't take any lip. I'll stay right here behind you and watch your progress. Pretty much, Junior Troopa is one of my favorite characters in this whole entire series. I really wish to use them more in, in later games. Now, I'm gonna spoil things ahead of time, but he, he ended up being an easter egg in Paper Mario 2, which I'm not gonna spoil anything about. Um, he ended up just being an easter egg. I think he was a card in Super Paper Mario, I'm not too sure, and obviously I don't think he returned in Sticker Star. Sticker Star is kind of like that one Paper Mario game that nobody wants to like put in the series for some reason just because of the game mechanics I think sticker star is kind of underrated honestly it's not the best paper Mario but I can say that it's okay paper jam is not paper Mario it's just um, it really is just a spin-off and we defeated junior Troopa just like that Mario that was wonderful fighting you she got star points you get star points every time you beat an enemy Every time you save up 100 star points, you'll go up a level. Always try hard to get points. No, oh, that's pretty good. We got some 20 points. Nice. Shoot, I was winning too. I'll be back, Mario. Goodbye, Egg. <laughs> I mean it, I'll be back. I went from like, yeah, yeah, to like, straight up Detroit kid. I don't know. Okay, let's break this block. We got a coin, which is okay. Um, I think we hit some trees. We can actually... Ooh, we get a mushroom, which is really nice. We got an item. It's the first item we got. If you guys end this game, to attack enemies to recover your HP. And a few other things. Pretty much, um, when you get items, you can pretty much use them. And in this game, it's really nice and convenient. Now, I think I actually shut off the menu. Um, pretty much have uh, our levels. Um, we have boots, hammers... Uh, star points, star pieces. We don't have any star pieces at all right now, but I'll be able to get some right in a bit. Um, we, I think I'll show that off right now. Here we can have a HP thingy. It heals up your HP. I think in later games this became chargeable, so Nintendo, why are you greedy in your own games? I have no idea. Here we get a fire flower, which is kind of the greatest items you get very early in the game. I mean, they get... You know, they don't become really good later on, but right at this point in the game, if you have a flower flower, you're... Fire flower? A fire flower, you're gonna have a good time with this. So as you can see, I, I hit the Goomba outside of battle, and I managed to get a first strike. This is uh, first striking, which means, you know, you attack whatever you do outside. And as you can see up there, there's a star piece, or I forgot what they're actually called here. Gotta hit that. Fair enough of me talking, we got a star piece and... Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, look at Groompa, dude. He's just dancing. Dancing around. Oh, what a cutie. I don't know. I think, I think the Goomba family in this game is really adorable. Um, it's kind of sad to say that, because we're kind of killing their own species right now in front of them. Uh, Red Bull gives you wings. I understand, but these guys are your same species. This is like some... I don't know genocide type of thing um not too sure Ooh, okay there's nothing we can do about that just yet but as you can see these are flying enemies um, um you barely could see uh, what menu item thing that was going but i couldn't use the hammer because they were in the air obviously we can't throw the hammer just yet yes you can get a hammer throw if you're curious right now 
Um, oh, we got another mushroom. Sweet. Okay, we have three items, actually. Um, we can't use the fire flower outside of battle. I don't think you can at all. But, hey, we managed to make it back to the village. So, don't worry, kids. I am here. Thanks to young Mario here. I made it back. All right. I made him sound so... I keep changing the voices for these characters. It might happen a lot. Oh, is that thing locked up? Let me open it for you. There we go. We're meeting up with the fam. Goompa, where you been? I looked outside and wow, both you and the veranda were just plain gone. Ah, I see. Goompa was very, very worried about you. Really worried. I see how it is. Sorry, kids. I apologize. I didn't mean to take you fret. Just take it easy now. Aw. I'm back safe and sound. Safe and sound. Okay, I'm sorry. I just had to. Okay, that song is really good. Shout out to Capital Cities, I think. I don't know. I'm stupid. Because I follow trends. Okay. Now, before I forget, I decided to give you something, Mario. Wait here a minute. He's gonna give us something, guys. I wonder what it is. I'm curious, guys. What is it? Huh, that doll you've got. That's the one that Goombaria lost. She was looking all over for it. Are we give back to her? Nah. I don't feel like... Nah, just kidding. I'm not mean. Here you go. Have your doll back. It's my dolly! Dolly, dolly, you're back! Thank you so much! I'm so happy! My sweet dolly! Don't you forget, I'm off again! Why oh, she went all southern? Here's a present for me, like a pretty glitter. We got a star piece, yes. If you do that doll thing, you get a star piece, and she'll give us a... eerie kiss, because she's like 12, and she just kissed a man that's like 30, who looks like El Chapo Guzman. Uh, you always seem to beat up your enemies. Do you work out? I mean, I study self-defense by reading books and masters. This seems dead goompa. I uh, exercise every day and I can be strong. Yeah, you, you, you don't have a neck. You, you don't have arms, but... <laughs> yeah, and Goombar's head is hard as a rock. <laughs> when he does his head bonk move, it really, really hurts. I'll be quiet, Goombar. You're embarrassing me. Of course it's true. Alright. Sorry to get you waiting, huh? <laughs> get you waiting, huh? It's okay, Goompa. We're just rapping with Mario. Oh my god, are you ready for this mixtape, guys? Oh my god, rapping? I just wanted to give this to Mario. He's giving me his mixtape! I got the power jump mixtape. Mario stomps on a single enemy with using a lot of attack power. Alright. This is called a badge. If you wear this, you'll be able to power jump, which means you'll be able to do a lot more damage with your jump attack. So listen here, listen well. You'll be able to do that if you're wearing the badge. No, you better put on the badge first. So. Uh, no, I didn't mean to. This is... Uh, whatever. Okay, so we're pretty much doing this simple tutorial that we could just do on our own. Pretty much you could put it, and then he's going to want you to take it off, and he wants you to get back. It's pretty much a bit a bait. Remember, you use flower points to use this power jump technique. And you remember you saw a block like this on the way back to the village? Well, these blocks will restore everything. Um, so they're lifesavers, Mario. Okay, so pretty much... He's explaining what badges do in the game, and the game revolves around badges, honestly. Uh, you can go three separate routes. You can go straight up, just leveling up your HP, leveling up your badge points, or leveling up your flower points. Honestly, for my playthrough, I'm going to be focusing more on getting more badge points than HP. I mean, I'm not going to do full-on, oh, let's just go for badges all the time. No. I'm... I'm gonna raise up my flower points, then my badge points, and then my HP, just so we can raise up everything, okay? Actually, well, I don't know. I'll think about what I'm gonna do after we get a level up. As soon as we get a level up, I think I'll know by then. Um, as soon, like, if we have a lot of badges by the time we level up, then I guess I'll put the badge points. But if we don't, then I'll go for the flower, okay? Prison rescuing is so cool, I really want to be an adventurer someday. Me too! Oh, here's an idea, Gumbario. Perhaps the timing is perfect. You're no longer a child, and evil times are upon us. I'm sure Mario agrees. You should accompany Mario. Oh no, I don't want this guy to be. Ah, man, go, Koomba, Mary, go. You gotta ask Mario. Why are you asking your grandpa? Your grandpa's like telling you to leave. But anyways, we got Gumbario. This is the first party member we get in the game, and pretty much he's our tattletale. So he will talk to us. He will let. We're pretty much. He will tell us uh, how many HP things have. He will give you a description. He's pretty much our Pokedex if you think about it. Uh, people, places, or things nearby. When you are interested, just ask him. Or is also helping on drawing battles. He can attack with head bunk. Or he will tell you enemies, features, and HP using his title ability. Okay, way to go, Gumbario. I know Gumbario will prove him to be a worthy companion. Well, I think it's about time for a nap. I'll be in the house. Goodbyes have a way of keeping this old Goomba get weepy. Yeah. 
gets weepy. Very weepy. Okay. <laughs> this is so cool, Mario. Let's go. Oh, wait. Your HP looks like a little low. Maybe you might take a rest at the Toad House. Um. Oh. Well, not a little low. Okay, so I accidentally used his Tattletail ability, but it's okay. Um. Let's take a rest real quick. Oh, do we have to talk to Toad? Yeah, we take a nap. Okay, we're gonna take a nap season, and I'll meet you guys back in a bit. Let's get this out of the way, and there we go, problem solved. I have a feeling your road will be lined with difficulty, so try not to overdo it. Be watchful, yet stay cool. A calm mind is always the wisest. Well, hang on, Mario. I noticed you're not wearing the badge Goompa gave you. Okay, that's true. We gotta wear the badge. Um, I don't know. Oh, I didn't even put it on, buddy. I didn't even put it on. Let's go. Okay, there we go. So we're good. We're good. We put the badge on. Everything's fine and dandy. Now, if you touch this, an enemy will spawn, but I'm not gonna fight you. I'm gonna fight these guys. So, ooh, okay. So now that we have partners, hey Mario, bring a battle. You can, yeah. Pretty much, he, we can change the order of attack with Z. Now I forgot what button I assigned for Z. So, ooh, okay, okay. I just realized what it was. Um, bonk. All right. I think if we tattle on one enemy, that's when the entire the, the enemy itself gets. Um, the HP checker, which, uh, at this point, I don't think it's worth, because I'm not going for 100% here. Like, I'm not going to go for every tattle, every everything. Um, so, Goomba's pretty much 2 HP. That's it. That's all I can say. Okay, we're good. I'm sorry, but the only way to get through the Red Goomba Blues is me, Red Goomba, and my brother, Green Goomba. I call him Green. <laughs> Let's get him, Blue Goomba. Get him, bro. Get on it. Why do I make him sound redneck as hell? Anyways, okay. This is our first mini boss fight. Now, since, you know, Tattle... We have the same HP, but I'm just going to Tattle one of them. This is Blue Goomba. He's a younger one. All right, we're going to attack the Luigi of the group. So, let's see what he's got. He has six HP. Now, this is going to be an easy fight. Bunk! Easy peasy. Hey Mario, I like some of this. Ooh, yeah, he does one HP. Ooh, he does one HP too. All right, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be good. I'm gonna be like, Aza! Both of you got hit. I mean, I could have ended him right there, but it's okay. One damage, not so bad. Ooh, okay, we're gonna get threatened here. Ouch. And double hit. Um, this one's okay. See, we can't have our storage here, so I'm just taking them out both. Exactly the same. Which is okay. Uh, I think we might actually get the level up here. Ooh. And he looks, see? The badge works, so we're good. Now, I'm sorry, Blue Goomba, but you're gone. Out of here! Alright. No! My little brother, you're paying for that, Mario! And. Goodbye! Oh, you're still living. Oh, I thought I was gonna, like. Okay, whatever. We're just gonna bunk and you're done. Okay, what? He's not done? He's, he's not done? Okay. Goombar, you get the finishing attack. Okay, there we go. I assumed that he was still alive or something. Um, don't mean to get a little up, but we almost died, so it's okay. Ah, I'll let you go for now. Goodbye. Have fun. Enjoy the stay, weather. Um, there's a save here, so. A save, go for it. You might want to save. Um, we're having a boss fight coming up. I think, yeah, we're gonna restore HP here. Let's go. And also, we haven't leveled up at all, but hey, it's okay. Let's just go up. We haven't evolved. I was gonna say evolved. This isn't Pokemon, Ruben. Jeez, Louise. Okay, this one is a bait. You don't want to do that. You'll get encountered with a spiny Goomba, so no. And whoa! 
the castle. We got our first castle in the game. Oh, they're running home. King Goomba, help us! Mario beat us up! Oh no, what's going on? What's going Ooh. What even is going on? Hey, look, Mario, see that building over there? I'm pretty sure there used to be a bridge on the other side. I wonder how to do it. I don't know. We can walk around, see what's going on, and what? Ooh. Ooh. Uh oh. Whoa, the Goomba King. So, Mario, it's true. You made it this far. Respect you for that. Unfortunately, this is as far as you'll ever get. Because I, the great, powerful King Goomba, will never see you get a match farther. <laughs> well, the Goomba is really huge. You're gonna match for Mario. Are you ready? You ready to go? Let's go. So, we got to fight these knuckleheads once again. Um, speaking about King Goomba, we got your back now. A lot of people don't know this about this battle, but this boss fight is really, really easy. Pretty much, all you gotta do is get your hammer and aim at the tree. Once you do that, the coconut will hit all of them. And it kills instantly the two brothers. It's pretty amazing. Well, let's just tattle just as how much HP he has. I think he has 10. Um, I read that correctly. He has 10. So we don't have to really use any PP here, but we gotta be careful. Um, once again, coconut tree does the three damage for me. Oh, never mind. That was useless. Don't do that after there's no fruit on the Goomba tree. Or coconut tree. I don't know what that is. Okay. Um. Uh, no, there's not multiple enemies here. Um, you know what? I'll go power jump. Fuck it. Alright. Hey, bonk. He should be done in the next turn. So it's okay. Ooh. Ready then. Alright, and one part jump should do it. Bonk! And he's done! We defeated King Goomba! Pretty simple. Alright, we're almost there for level up, but it's okay. It's okay. What? How could I lose? Oh no, poor him. Yeah, I know we could do a cool victory! Haha, <laughs> Mario. Okay. So now we're gonna look for- ooh, star piece. Okay, so we got three of these now, which is pretty neat. Now, I'll tell you what they do later on. Oh, look at them, they're all doing stuff, and hey, we found a button! I love buttons! Uh, Mario, good fight and all that, but I must warn you, however, if you happen to find a strange switch somewhere, you should do not press it, okay? Don't- oh, we already pressed it. Sorry, buddy! Nice to see you! Goodbye! Get out of here! What happens to them, though? I don't remember what- oh. Oh no! <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> oh, uh, does this count as like demolishing a building? Oh my goodness! Aw, Team Rocket's blasted up again! Well, that did something. Look, the bridge! Now we can cross it and continue with our journey. Alright! So that's pretty good, I guess. Um, poor, poor Goomba King. That's all that happened to him. GG. And whoa, 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 this bitch. Hmm. Hey, you get out of here with your farting broom of wisdom or whatever. GG. And we're gonna save and continue. Let's see what's next. Aw. All right. Let's see what's going on with Princess Peach. Let's see what's going on with Princess Peach. Hmm. Fire King Bowser, I've been looking for you. A report your evil niche Mario you defeated the Goomba King. He's heading for Toe Town now. I made her sound like Miss Fowl in the last episode. I made her sound like Mike Myers and Austin Powers as a Dr. Evil. What unbelievable! That was the Goomba King thinking. I used to start right bank of a king because he bit me. Mario whips him so easily. What a wimp. Oh, uh, can't be cool. Are you sure the Mario can't defeat us, right? Please, please, your villain. Let's try to be calm. King Goomba King is a small time man. Feeling can't fail. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so pretty much Bowser has all the power. And he can defeat us whenever he wants. Because he has a star rod. So, if Mario reaches there, he can. Can the Koopa Bros defeat him? Uh, yeah, Koopa Bros Fortress. Must you worry? Hmm? What's going on? Hiya! Whoa! Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles! Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles! Heroes in a half shell! Turtle power! <laughs> These guys are lit. Um. Yeah. Shaw! 
Get real, King Bowser. Yeah, the Goomba King was huge. He was a tumble Wimpola. We're nothing like him. See, we've got what going on is the power of teamwork. We can put Mario in the hurt. The second is flat. That's it, sell it, niggas. Sell it, my bros. Let's a go. Ooh, he's seen their junk. I like it. <laughs> he's showing them their special attack. Oh my goodness. By the way, my Cooper Bros, how about we capture that Star Spirit locked up in your Oh, we know where they are now. We know where one of them is. You really is, use your edge. Get back to the fortress and guard that Star Spirit. <laughs> now, how'd they get up there? This thing is in the sky. But whatever. Let's just keep going with our journey. And. I don't know if there's something here. No, I'm not gonna use the mushroom. Good. Ooh, we get a block. Let's see what this is. We get a sleepy sheep, which will make enemies fall asleep during battle. Um. Also, if you do this, boink, you get a spring, which will lead you up here. And you get a. Da 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 da. A hammer throw badge. This is the badge I was talking about. Um, you can equip it. I think I'll equip it right now. Just so we can get some flying enemies, but. Um. Wait. That. Uh, what? <laughs> menu? I'm so stupid. Okay, and nope, we don't have enough to get it, so we're gonna have to level up to get to it. Anyways, guys, we have made it back to Toad Town. Incredible. Alright. Let's get started. Mario, I'm so glad you're okay. The town is an uproar. The princess has kidnapped the very castle uprooted. It's a bedlam. I really don't know what I can do all about this. Please, Mario, save her highness. Oh, well, maybe, yeah. We'll save her. In the next episode, thank you guys for watching. My name is Ruben Kings. I hope you enjoyed this video, and here we find Luigi singing some tunes. Um, so I'm gonna end the episode off here. I wonder what my brother Mario is doing right now. Hey, Luigi. Whoa, Mario, it's good to see you. Where the fuck were you, man? Huh? Where the fuck were you? After all those calls are crazy, we're really worried about you. I just ran outside. Okay, Luigi. Luigi? What's wrong? Luigi? Oh, who are you? I'm Goombari, nice to meet you. I see, great. Just good at you taking a die. Next time. <laughs> Luigi's jealous! Okay. Well, Luigi, stop being so salty and just, you know, enjoy everything you have. Now you can fall asleep in the bed. So, yes. Let's all go to sleep. Nighty night. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace. <laughs>